Here we are in my backyard. You can hear my wind chimes there jingling away in February. I have put four buckets on this tree and it's covered, I don't know, maybe a quarter of the diameter of this giant silver maple. This is the one a number of years ago, if any of you were following here, uh, we banded this tree because it's splitting in half and I wanted to keep it for a couple of more years. So in addition to the buckets and spiles, I've also put spiles with hoses and into five gallon water jugs. It means that I don't have to dump the buckets as often. Now they are quite a bit heavier, uh, but it saves me some time in emptying. So I'll show you a close-up. There is the spile. Same way, drilled into the tree, hammered into the tree, and then I just stick the hose on the end of the spile and follow the hose down into the bucket. You probably can't see that very well. It's a bit shady. So we'll go over here where you can see it a little bit better. There you go. Modern method old-fashioned method. Welcome to maple syrup time in southwestern Ontario. In the city, no less.